So today what we're going to talk about is hood and chemical safety. Um, one of the most important things about this is to um, start with the forms. So on the side of the hood here, we have a hazardous waste log sheet. This is where you're going to um, mark when you are adding waste to our um, satellite accumulation area. Additionally, if you work in the hood on a particular day, you have to fill out a hazardous waste accumulation area checklist. This is particularly important um, and required by law. So this is our hood. The hood has a, a wide variety of things um, in it. The first of which is um, this gray bin. This gray bin is called a satellite accumulation area. This is where we keep hazardous chemicals. Each of those chemicals is labeled, um, so please do not mix waste. If you have a question about where to dispose of your waste, um, please ask. Um, if a waste container is full, you need to let me know, as well as Mary Hughes, who, who is our chemical safety officer. Um, the waste in here is both liquid and dry waste, and so um, it is particularly important that you do not mix those two things. Additionally, the waste needs to be in the secondary containment bin um, so that it is um, not actually um, on the hood surface unless you are using it. Another thing that's particularly important about the hood is that the sash, which is this glass here, is actually um, at or below the sash position. That is so that, um, one, you have protection um, for your eyes, and two, so that there is optimal airflow up into the hood and out the vent. Um, you know that uh, the hood is working by looking at the um, velocity meter here. The remainder of the hood should stay um, clean and organized. So um, we have another secondary containment here that contains um, smaller volumes of chemicals and washes for the homogenizer. Um, so those need to stay in secondary containment. We have a set of pipetters that stay in the hood. We have um, pipette tips that stay in the hood um, and some other tools. So please um, keep those organized. And if you spill anything in the hood, um, you need to clean it up, put it in the secondary containment waste. If it is a large spill, you need to let uh, Mary or myself know. And if it is a particularly large spill, you need to leave the area um, and call security.